Good morning. Thursday already, September 3rd, and this is Wise Words from Waldo. Yesterday I shared a devotion about obedience. The point was that obedience to God really shows how much we love Him. Today's devotion is more about love than obedience. Someone once said, I love mankind. It's the people I can't stand. During a few of the difficult times I've had as a pastor, I've thought, someday I'd like to pastor a big church with no people in it. <laughs> it certainly helps me to be thankful for the church family that I have here. Sam Rayburn was Speaker of the House for the House of Representatives for a long time. One of his friends lost a teenage daughter. Early the next morning, Rayburn knocked on his door. I just came by to see if I could help in any way. The father replied, No, there's really nothing you can do, but thanks. Rayburn asked, Have you had breakfast? The man replied that they really hadn't even thought about it. Rayburn walked past him into his house, walked in the kitchen, and began to make breakfast. The father came in and said, Wait a minute. Aren't you supposed to be at the White House having breakfast with the president this morning? I was, Rayburn said. But I called and said that I had a friend who needed me today. That's the kind of love we're to have for people, for our neighbors, our friends, our family. I know, some people are hard to love, but so are you, and so am I. And God, He loved us while we were yet sinners. Will you show genuine love today? The pastor brought home the biggest bouquet of flowers you have ever seen to his wife. After all, he'd forgotten their anniversary. She said, Oh, you're forgiven. These must have cost you a fortune. His reply, Nothing is too much for you, dear. Just then the phone rang. She answered, Really? Well, thank you. Yes, I'll tell him. She hung up. She turned to her husband and said, That was the funeral director from the funeral you did today. He asked if you had any idea who took the flowers from the cemetery today. Well, genuinely try to love someone today. Now stop and think about that.